we begin tonight with an Amber Alert issued for a two-year-old boy. Mark Leeson was abducted from his grandmother's Lamarck home and is believed to be in grave danger tonight. Police say he is with his mother, 18-year-old Haley Richter, and her boyfriend, 21-year-old Zekius McCullum. These are their pictures. Our Jennifer Bauer just spoke with the boy's grandmother. She joins us live now. Jen, we understand the grandmother was assaulted during this kidnapping. That's right. In fact, they sprayed her with mace and threw her down on the ground the entire time. She says the baby was screaming for his grandmother. He's my grandson. I've had him since the day he was born. Amanda Leeson says her daughter Haley may have given birth to Mark two years ago, but she hasn't been part of his life at all. Amanda has custody of him. He does not know Haley. He knows her as Haley. I am his mother. Haley and her boyfriend, Zacchaeus McCollum, came to the Leeson's home today unexpectedly for a visit. She didn't even say anything. She didn't even act out of the ordinary. Literally, she just picked the baby up to give him a hug and a kiss, whatever. And next thing I know, I'm being maced and shoved into the wall, and they're leaving with him. Amanda and the police are worried about Mark's safety. An Amber Alert was issued for him this evening. You're asked to be on the lookout for Haley and Zacchaeus and little Mark. They're driving a dark maroon Jeep Grand Cherokee with a Texas license plate number FTM 1941. Mark's family is worried sick. She doesn't even know this baby. That is my baby. She birthed him and I have raised him. Physically, financially, emotionally, I'm, I'm the one that is set up with him when he's sick and bathe him and feed him. And, and I'm here with him every single day. Now, Amanda thinks they may try to alter their appearances. She said she wouldn't be surprised if they cut the baby's hair or even shave his head. She also wants people out there to know that they both have very visible tattoos, uh, tattooed their names right across the tops of their hands. She, of course, wants people to be on the lookout. Anyone with information should contact 911 or call the police right away. We're live in Lamarck tonight. I'm Jennifer Bauer, KPRC Channel 2 News. Thank you so